to run off this training we will be looking at the last tool we are trying to solve on this network analysis so um yeah you have to do yourself favor by going through all our previous videos to look at what we've done so far to where we are now okay so um today we'll be looking at the new od cost matrix so you click on it on the network analyst then you also come here and click is going to bring out the OD. so here it is it's more like what we've done previously that's like um, the closest facilities so where we have the origin that we have facility and we have uh incident but this time around we have origins and we have destinations so our origin will be um will be we we'll use hospital now origin will be the hospital okay we have six hospitals then our destination will be residential okay so uh, let's go to the residential and then we'll load it it's going to take time just as usual and let me post it post it and come back when it's done okay it has loaded successfully and then um, so we'll go back to the settings we'll use minute this time and then we we'll use just one minute or let's say two minutes let's use one minute if you do not do then we'll change to two minutes okay so uh okay and then we give it a solve so let's solve it has generated 38,634 lines so let's look at it as okay so this way the lines is generated for the OD for one minute so you could reduce it and then so this is basically how it's been done within the lines the, the root segment we generated this so that's the um, OD matrix but basically this is okay let's yeah let's remove this the destination and allow our residential to appear so that so let's allow our residential to appear so you see basically what the OD has done, it uses the residential uh, this thing to generate the So because of the weight of the whole thing, that's why it's that heavy. But then now you can look at how what is has generated generated the line segment around all the places that has the um, the residential because the residential was our destination from the origin. So it extend that line. So this is how you can run the OD matrix analysis. All right, so. This brings us to the end of this network uh, analysis. I will be starting a new one. The whole of this analysis, we start it with, uh, we use shapefile all through. So we'll be using the geodatabase to do the other one. So we'll be doing everything the same, but just using geodatabase and see how it's been carried out. So it keeps tuned with us and then support us in any way you can. For now, I love you and bye-bye.